Hey guys, Tommy here, and uh, I just got out of surgery. This stream, I'm going to explain how it happened, why, and how I am now. Spoiler, everything hurts. Also, it's two and a half weeks till I leave for America for my comedy tour, so go to Tommy.com if you haven't got yourself tickets yet. Enjoy. How are we doing today? Me? I'm a little achy. <laughs> we got a hype train going. Thank you uh, for the for the level three hype train. There's too many subs going by. So here's the thing, chat. I'm just going to open the stream by saying this quite out loud. I'm still on drugs, all right? Uh, for the surgery, they put me under general anesthetic, and I've just been having a weird... It was two days ago. Uh, so if I seem weird today, it's because I'm on drugs. Specifically heroin. Well, not it's not actually heroin, but the, one of the things in the thing is the same thing that's in heroin. So I'm not on heroin, though. I'm obviously not. But, um... Hey... <laughs> so if I seem a bit loopy today, that is a... Uh, I played the wrong fucking song. That's why, okay? Uh... <laughs> uh, hey guys, what's up? How we doing? <laughs> 50 gifted from Fluffy Kirby, and did I see 50 gifted from Liliana? Fuck off, mate. What? So many subs, man. I should destroy my testicles more often. CMO Gaming with the eight months. Yo, what's up, Tommy? It's me, CMO. What's up, CMO? It's me, Tommy. Um, swag time, think of the 42 months. It's a mine, think for the 39 months. Jesus Christ. Guys, there's a lot of subs coming in. <laughs> Thank you. Fluffy Kirby with the 50 gifted subs, you bastard. Lily Hannah with the 50. You lot are mental, man. Thank you so much. How you doing, alright? Um. Thank you, Miffy, for the uh, 32 months. Congrats on getting cancelled on Twitter for having ball surgery. Yeah, people really shouldn't be having ball surgery these days. It's really not very woke of them, you know. Uh, so anyway, guys, you will want to know what's happened, uh, why there's that image of me, what's been going on. Now, this might, again, this might be a shorter stream than usual, as I'm just getting real pangs of tiredness, like a real pa- I I've had three hours of naps today, and I think four hours of naps yesterday. I've watched six films in the past 48 hours. What I did do for Valentine's Day is get Molly Animal Crossing, so we sat together and played Animal Crossing, but that that's why I'm- how my balls now? Really, really, really terribly achy. Um, so look, I'm just gonna start by saying, if you see me in public, I, I walk like this now. Like Godzilla. Uh, cause it, cause if they touch, if they touch guys, that's so cute. No, it's not, it really hurts. If they touch, here's how I, here's how I describe it. Uh, if a piece of fabric were to touch my crotch area, if you were to prod them, to me, it would feel like someone has gone, so I'm actually feeling extreme aches and pain at the minute. Uh, so I've been kind of stomping around the schlatt walk. Please, no, come on. Uh, so <laughs> it's actually really not ideal, especially given I'm doing, uh, I don't know if you know, there's a whole America tour in two and a half weeks. Um, so I've really got a rest up and rehearsals for that start tomorrow. So I'm kind of, uh, kind of going uh, crazy at the moment. Um, but no, I've been resting, I've been doing bare drugs, but let's, should we get into it? It's a bit TMI, isn't it? That's true. That's a good point to make. Guys, if you're worried about TMI, then you should click off this stream. I have lost a, a sense of boundaries. I've already spoke to a few people the past few days. Uh, so th this is going to be TMI. <laughs> so if you don't want to hear about it, uh, now's your time to, to click off. The tour's not getting cancelled at all. Don't worry, I should be fine. I should be fine. The very serious bull doctor... Told me I should be fine. Who's that in chat? Average Harry. Tell him about your jock strap. Yeah, so that's the other fun thing. That's the other fun thing. Um, I have to wear... <sighs> Alright. No. This is... Let's tell the story. Do you guys want to hear it? What's been going on with me? Yeah? Okay. Alright. So, a few months ago, uh, I woke up Sat there, actually, in excruciating pain. You might have seen that story. You might have seen me tweet about it. Uh, I had a thing that's really fun, really awesome, called testicular torsion. Basically, your balls twist. Uh, and and it and it's the mo one of the actually the most painful thing. It was excruciatingly painful. It was excruciatingly painful. Uh, and so I went to the doctor, went to the hospital. You found out all about that. Uh, and they said, look, if we're going to fix this so it doesn't happen again, because it turns out me, that's right, guys, your boy, your streamer, Tommy in it, is prone to ball twists. How fun is that? Uh, what kind of good, uh, what's it called? 
cannon look. And what am I on about? What's it called? The look that you have when you're a character. I'm sure I'm. I'm sure I know it. What's the word, guys? Oh, someone's gonna tell me. Plot armor. Yeah, great. So my, evidently my plot armor wore off. Uh, so and my balls started twisting. Not the best time for a resub. No, it is, man. I, I really need it now. Thank you, Phoenix. Guys, if you do want to sub, hit subscribe and Prime or Tier One or Gift. You know, it, it's pity subs today. Uh, and I and I don't feel bad about it today. You know, uh, today I I deserve it. Um, <laughs> so the plot armor wore off. Um, so I go in and I go, look, like, can, can we fix this? They go, yeah, you need to have surgery. Uh, I go, that, I don't want surgery, I'm terrified of surgery. But they go, well, it turns out if you want to go on your America tour and you want to get insured, because here's what could happen, here's a fun thing, is I could be out in the middle of the road in America alone, you know, let's say between two of the shows, right? So you know I'm doing an America comedy tour. Uh, I could be out between two shows, no doctors, massive travel days, and I, my balls could twist. And it could result in what I found out is your ball can die. Did you know that? I didn't. They can. They can just die. You know, they have they have one cannon life and it can go. Uh, and I didn't want to lose my balls. You know, I intend on starting a very successful family channel. I want to pump out eight to ten young men. Um, so it was important to me that this doesn't happen. Yeah, yeah. Hardcore mode, right? So, um, so I say is right. Well, let's get the surgery done. Um, so over like months. Thank you for gifting twenty subs, Cling HQ. I appreciate that a lot. Fifty months of your recovery is going well. Thank you so much. Sorry, thank you for the uh, 35 months. This is how I show my sub anniversary. No, I appreciate it a lot. Um, 8 to 10? Bro, you're going to be busy? No, no, no. I do it all in one big jar, you know, with the U2s in. And that, then, um, <laughs> so, um, yeah, press F for his balls. Let's not get Fs in the chat. Um, so, yeah, anyway. Um... I found out I need to have surgery. Really, really have to, especially if I'm going to have this this uh, tour. Thank you so much for the Fs, guys. It's very appreciated. Um, so I really delay that. I really, really delay it. And I didn't really talk about this on stream up until now because I was really scared about it. I'll be vulnerable with you all. I was really, really scared. I don't want the surgery. So um, I go into the doctors. I go in um, about two weeks before, maybe a month before the surgery, and I go, you know what? We sort it out, we figure out what it's going to be, he goes, cool, we figure out a date, that's going to be cool. And I'm, and then I do the worst thing I've ever done, guys. I did the stupidest thing I've ever done. I go, Mr. Ball Doctor, what is the surgery? What, what is, what, what, what does it entail? And he said, oh, it's nothing. And I went, no, please, I'd love to know. And he went, and I'll, I'll bleep this for you. So I freaked out. I freaked out quite a lot. Because when someone tells you how they're going to disembody you, it's one of the least pleasant experiences of your whole life. So I freak out, and I ring at my parents, and I'm I'm really panicking. And I'm stood alone in Haywards Heath, God forbid, Haywards Heath Hospital, alone, freaking the fuck out uh, on like a Tuesday morning. And I ring my mum, and I go, Mom, please, please, Jesus Christ, this is, this is the thing. you got to help me, Mum. Um... And I figure out some coping mechanisms. I, I I started just... I really had to imagine, like... So I just going, I'm a Pokemon. I'm a Pokemon. I'm in a Pokeball. I'm a Pokemon. I'm in a Pokeball. And I'm healing. I'm healing. I'm a Pokemon. And I'm in a Pokeball. And they're going to heal me. They're going to heal me. Boop, 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 doo, doo. And, then I, and then I start writing down. Because as you know, I've been doing stand-up at the moment. I've been doing, like, comedy live. So I'm writing this down as a joke. And I wrote... I, let me find the exact thing I, I wrote down. Because it was powerful. If you can see, my humor is a little bit more dry today, guys. Um, um, <laughs> this is this is the world's. This is, I, so I wrote this down mid panic. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna read this to you. Do you like my exact notes? This is my notes while I was freaking out. Uh, an unpleasant stream. Thank you, maybe summer. My notes while I was freaking out to death about my balls. I wrote, "Trainee doctor, touch my balls. Explain to her how." Um, panic attack very almost at what till be, so I put on Pokemon Center music and pretend I'm a Pokemon. This is funny. This is funny. This is funny. This is funny. Um, 
Mum and Dad said if you think about giving birth or getting circumcised, you would want to die. So don't think about it. This is how I this is how I comforted myself. Um, and I just kept writing. This is funny because it, it is funny, you know. I'm stood alone, really cold, pacing around, really in depth, imagining my own balls. That's funny, you know. Try and imagine that because that's a real thing that happened. This is hilarious. Thank you so much. Um, so anyway, then a few weeks go by and I get the date for the surgery, which is three days ago, and uh, I go in. <sighs> I go in and I'm not allowed to eat or drink any water. Uh, the night before, I go to the June 2 premiere with the Jack and the Jack and Phil and, and Kristen and Captain Puffy was there as well. Uh, I go to this June 2 premiere uh, and it was fucking amazing, this new film. I'm not allowed to talk about it apparently or I'll get sued because uh, it's not out yet, but it was amazing. Um, but I go there and Facebook's paid for all the food and I know that the next day I'm not going to be able to eat any food. So there's all this fucking food, so I'm just eating it all and it was really, it was going to waste guys. So I just kept eating all this, all this food. Um, so this is the night before the surgery at the June 2 premiere, uh, which I'll tell you a little bit about. Yeah, Jack arrived an hour late in classic manifold time. Phil arrived as dressed up as possible for someone from Newcastle. If you've seen what Phil looked like, by the way, it was horrible. Um, no one ever eats at Premiere, mate. I feel bad greedy. Yeah, yeah, no one was eating. No one was eating, and there was just all this free food, so I was eating it and eating it and eating it. Uh, and we watched the film, and then afterwards, I they gave you free popcorn, but not everyone took their free popcorn. So I, in fact, I... Oh! One sec! So I take the free popcorn, because I noticed... Oh, 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 fucking hell. I noticed no one else is taking the popcorn, so I take all this free popcorn. Um, for me, and I suppose Molly. And they were just giving this out, and no one, uh, no one, no one was taking it, so... Oh. It's nice, too. It's real nice. Then he waddled away. Fuck off, mate. Actually, fuck off. <laughs> fuck sake. Oh, fuck! I just spilled popcorn. Oh, I can't bend over to... <clears throat> One sec, man. One sec. Be patient. I've got popcorn all over me fucking floor. Oh, for fuck's sake. Let me shut the door properly as well, you lot, because Aaron's in, so I don't want to... I will have a bit more of that popcorn in a minute. Please stop saying any waddle away, guys. Anyway. Um, so I take all that popcorn, I come home. What will that person say? Going into big surgery in a few days and I'm scared and I'm glad you're okay and that hopes me. Doing it for you, Wilbur Slays. One, two, three, four. Sorry, I thought of, didn't realise I was your username. But I'm glad you're going into the surgery. <laughs> That's how I do it for, man. Wilbur Slays. Alright. So yeah, I um Tell me you're not real. No, I am. I am, no, and the and the yeah, the pain is real. Uh so anyway, I'm going for the surgery. It's a really, really nice sort of hospital. Um we go in uh, and I'm not allowed to eat for the whole morning. So I get up at half seven, eat, uh some cornflakes and a bacon sandwich and we go. And I'm also not allowed to drink for the hour before. Now I don't know if you know what it's like to not eat or drink for hours, it, it sucks actually, it's really shit. Despite what that crap Mr. Beast video will tell you. It, it, it is terrible. It's really bad. Um, <laughs> sorry, you might be able to tell, I'm actually in one of the lower moods of my... <laughs> I've just sat here fucking well annoyed. Kajio, thank you for the uh, two months, mate, thank you so much. Annie Waldo away, oh sure, man. Hope you're feeling okay, just came to the stream, so if you're not, I'm so sorry. It's alright, Miss Shippy, I'm, I'm alright. So I get so I get here. Always bring a bag of snacks. Well, I wasn't allowed one, was I? Because I'm not allowed to eat for the surgery in case I shit myself. So anyway, I get to the surgery area. Over the next three hours, my dad took me. <laughs> Stupid. Uh, my dad, my dad took me. Um, and we sit and chat for three hours because it, you take quite a long time. It turns out before they uh, come out. Yeah, takes quite a long time. Um, 
Plums can get you. And in these three hours, many doctors come and visit me pre-surgery. Now, I'll be honest with you guys. I've never had surgery. I was shuddering beforehand. I was really, really panicked. Uh, especially given it's ball surgery. As you know, if you know me, you've heard the Jack Manifold story about when he explained about the G-spot and the arsehole. I really don't... I'm really not equipped for this kind of body horror stuff. I'm really not kind of equipped for it. So, um... I wasn't ready. I really wasn't. Um... Everyone knows this story when Jack explained to me about the arseholes. Um, I don't, I don't, I'm not going to get into it. Freak you out as much as it freaked me out. Um, but yes, so, um, <laughs> this doctor comes in. He's a very serious doctor. He starts, um, chatting to me a bit. And I ask him a question that I thought was a bit silly. I go, see, you know, you put the sleep serum in, so I go to sleep for the surgery. If I really try and stay awake, would I be able to? Because I bet I've got it in me. And he went... You can try, but you will not succeed. It's a matter of man versus chemical. And let me tell you, chemical always wins. And I was like, holy sh, this guy's fucking, this guy's a fucking doctor. Uh, and then after that, the bull doctor came in and he was really seriously explaining to me about trans king. That's not what this is. That, I'm, I'm not, um, I think, uh, I'm an ally for sure, but that, no, that, um, it was a it was a ball surgery. Moving on, um, <laughs> uh, so the ball man comes in and he's telling me he's really intensely telling me about um, ball my balls balls and all the ball surgeries he's done. And I was thinking in my head, this is the ball man. This man studied ball surgery for a long time, so he can sit here and tell me about balls. And, and I found I that was starting to make me laugh, but I had to keep it serious because again, he was really intently ex talking about balls. To me. Um, anyway, a few hours ago, by finally, finally, it's my time to go in. Uh, say bye to my dad. And this, this male nurse man comes and gets me. And I am really shuddering. Now, I'm, I'm really freaking out uh, quite a lot. Because um, I don't... I, I don't know if you know this, I really don't want... I've never been put under. I really don't like the idea of thinking about these people sort of fixing my balls and that process. Um... So they slowly take me up. Was the anesthesia scary? I'll get to it. So slowly take me up. And I'm I'm like I'm properly shuddering, man. And I go uh, to the guy like, oh man, you know, when I'm panicking, I just I try and imagine my favourite Star Wars scenes. He goes, oh, I love Star Wars. So me and this bloke, <laughs> he's about to, you know, open me up. We just start talking about Star Wars, and then he takes me all the way upstairs. Takes me into the the operating theatre, and there's two other guys, and they're all, I'm also like, can we just talk about Star Wars? And they're like, oh yeah, sure. So these guys are talking about styles with me, and this is one uh, in the operating theater now, and, I'm, and they're starting to put all the shit on me, you know, like in ET when they put all the stuff on. They're doing that, and I'm like, you know, and I'm wearing this gown where there's really nothing underneath, you know, I I'm pretty exposed. Um, but still, we're talking about Star Wars, you know. I'm going, I don't know if you know this. Carl Jacobs told me the other day, but uh, Ewoks never actually called Ewoks in the film. They never referred to as Ewoks in Return of the Jedi. First time they were was on the. Uh, the toys, they were going, all right, kids, let's put you to sleep. Um, but uh, no, no, and there was this one doctor who had quite a big bogey, and, I, and obviously I didn't want to tell him, I didn't want to, but also he was, I, what I didn't want was for the bogey to fall, you know, um, so that was quite awkward, but I thought I'd power through that. And then the really serious doctor was in the room, and the bogey doctor went, who was really lovely, but he was absolutely lovely, he did just have a bogey, um, and the bogey doctor went, oh, you know what though, like, um, I just don't know why George Lucas made the prequels. You know, I just feel like it would have been better with the first three. And the serious doctor, the really serious doctor, you know, Mr. Stay Awake, Mr. Chemical Always Win, looked at that man and went, George Lucas always intended to do prequels. He always intended to do 12 films. That's why he began with episode four, five, and six. To insinuate he wouldn't have wanted to do that would be ridiculous. And I was like, this is fucking awesome. And while he was doing that, he put in the sleep serum and he went, by the way, I've put that in. And I went, oh, what the fuck? So he drugged me. Um, <laughs> I was so, so taking it into his argument. I was like, oh, oh, wow, okay. And he goes, for so the first two minutes, it's going to feel really cold. And I was like, wow, it does feel cold. And I was like, no, I can stay awake. And he goes, that's going to feel like you've had a few drinks. And I was like, holy fuck. This is magical! And then I fell asleep. And that was it. I didn't feel anything for it. I don't, I don't know what happened. And then I woke up. In this room with like f five other doctors. 
And I didn't know what was happened. But I, all I remember now is I, I made them laugh a lot. I can't really remember what I said. But I was doing bits. I was drugged up. And I kept going, can I, like, have my phone? And they were like, that's downstairs. But I was drugged up and I was doing bits. But I can't remember any of them. Like, any. Any of them. Um, and then finally they took me down. And I went, oh, mate, can you just help me film this TikTok? So, you know that TikTok I filmed? That was a doctor film now. And I was on drugs. Um, <laughs> I was on a lot. You, talk, you started texting the group chat. It was Mint. Did I really? I don't even... I can't even remember that. Anyway. So this happens. So the surgery's done. I've done it. I'm drugged out of my mind, but it's great. 11 months sub, nearly one year. Glad the ball surgery went well. Thank you so much, Em. Thank you so much. Thank you. I survived it. I survived it. I'm a little freaked out, but I survived it. Now, if I'm to leave for the surgery... Um, it's when you're fully okay because I'm really worried about my surgery. You're going to be fine, Wilbur Slays1234. Don't you worry, mate. Let's all get a heart in chat for Wilbur underscore Slays1234. Surgery's a bit scary, but look, honestly, mate, it just feels like you pissed before they put you under. Don't worry about it. You're going to do fine, King. It was well stressful for me, but you'll be right. Also, I have my balls surgeoned. Unless it's your arsehole, there's not really anywhere else worse that you can get surgery done. Anyway, before I was to leave the hospital, I had to wee. Uh, so I sat around for a few hours, had many good chats with my dad again, still more about June 2 and, uh, and uh, Star Wars. I had eye surgery. Oh, God! That's way worse! Oh, fuck off! Don't tell me about that, you weirdo. Sorry, that was a, that was a harsh reaction. I, I, I just don't want to hear about... Sorry, come on, I've been through enough. Sorry. Um, anyway, so I go to the doctors. I have to. I have to. I have to. I have to pee. When I leave. This is going to be the most TMI bit of the whole stream, by the way. So if you now will be the time. So I go to the toilet, and I and I see. I see for the first time. I see. Now. I'd like to say that my respect for women has gone vastly upwards. It was already quite high before, but now I've I've bled from places I never thought I would. And let me just say, you have to go through that every month, and I absolutely commend you. I could never, please. Well done, guys. Seriously, because I, you know, I'll just be totally honest with you. Yeah, it was horrid. Still is. No, you're very welcome, guys. You're very welcome. And good, you know? Thank you. You know, you're so welcome. It's all right, guys. Uh, but then I freaked out. I had a real big freak out, uh, you know? Which isn't kind of ideal. But I had a real big freak out. Turns out, you know, I've been hearing this whole time and all my friends' songs about attacks of the panic. You think they're going to be fun? <laughs> Turns out they're actually not. They're actually really not. Um, so I didn't enjoy my first one of those. That, was, that wasn't that was ideal. Um, and that was after I'd done the tweet. I tweeted about it. I was like, yeah, man, I'm fucking awesome. Uh, and then I and then I, and I saw. Uh, anyway. So then I, 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 I came home. And I, uh, I had my piss. But before I left, they told me something. They go, by the way. You, you might notice you're wearing very tight pants. You guys know what a jock strap is? Let me show you an image. Let me show you a really sick image. <laughs> Harry, I didn't even know I sent that to you. you know what a jock strap is? Let me try to find one that looks slightly appealing. Yeah, okay. This might be good. Uh, do I have a webcam? I'm just hoping this isn't going to leak everything. Nice. This. So it's essentially uh, incredibly tight pants. Really tight. Really ball excruciatingly tight pants. I go, um, I've got those on. She goes, yeah, yeah. I'm going to go check with the doctor how long you have to wear them for. I think, oh, phew, okay, maybe, maybe a day or two. She comes back. Six weeks. 
And let me tell you, when I found out this information, I was not over the moon. So, uh, that was really unpleasant. Then I had to start walking. Uh, that was really unpleasant, you know? Because again, every, every step felt like... Pew, pew, pew. I felt like I was back in fucking school, man. And they, do, you, do you guys have Bangkoks at your school? This might just be a Nottingham thing where they walk past you and go, Oh, mate, what's the capital of Thailand? Bangkok! And they just punch you in your balls. Yeah, they did that at my school. You know? They did, that might be what caused it. Yeah, 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 no, no, that's what they did in, in my school. Um, so, yeah, I'm really glad that doesn't happen anymore. But I will say, it feels like every step that's happening. So it wasn't over the moon about that. Really, really wasn't. Um, and I've just spent the past two days on the sofa. Today I went for a small walk with Molly, and, and then I had to lie down for three hours. Two hours, an hour. You know, that's not over exaggerate. Uh, <laughs> the screenshot Harry just sent me from our chat that I, I actually have no memory of. <laughs> it's a photo of me and my mask, and Harry said, Oh, look, it's like you as Bane. And I replied, ha, 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 it's Tom Hardy. <laughs> Which I, I'm sorry to think it wasn't the crux of Harry's joke. But nevertheless, I appreciate it. I'm going insane. I just I don't feel amazing. Uh, I'll be honest with you. I, I I've been waking up very uh very different times. Um, uh, um yeah, it's not the best time. Nice Molly being here. We sat and just played Animal Crossing. We both have pear islands, so isn't that fun? I had ear surgery at five. Great. No, really great. I'm 14 and I've had 10 surgeries on my right leg. And you got rid of that message box. <laughs> Glad I didn't finish reading it. Um, but yeah, yeah. So that's kind of where I'm at. Um, anyone have any questions? I can't sit. I really like the stream gave me soul surgery. So no, I'm not. I can't really sit um, how I'd like to. My legs have to be very fine. I'm like permanently manspreading. Did you want streamer awards? I actually just skimmed through the bits with Tubbo this morning. Me and Molly did, and then I and then I turned it off. Yeah, but um, rehearsals for the show start tomorrow. It's weird. I kind of think about things in like little segments. Um. And uh, I kind of forgot, I'll be honest, guys, I kind of forgot that I'm, in two and a half weeks, I leave for America for, um, a, like, a very long two months. That's quite exciting, isn't it? I, that's that's amazing. Uh, Cliff, are you eating Prime at the Stream Awards? Yes. Um, yeah. So I've sort of just started thinking about that and going, oh, fucking hell, yeah. Um, and yeah, yeah, I'm aware I didn't stream very much after being like, guys, I'm going to stream those this year. I've filmed, I've filmed, I think, let me count. So, you know, I'm about to go away for two months. It would have been two months with no uploads, but I said, fuck that shit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine videos I've filmed. And I'm going to film, I think, two more over this week. So you're going to get a lot. And I've also uh, sort of came up with a slightly new style of video. It's going to be on Tommy in it as well. Um, so I hope you guys enjoy that. Kind of a... <laughs> anyway, geez, man, it's kind of like my old Tom A videos. Um, I like that one I did in 2021 of, like, reacting to comments. Um, did you ever watch that channel? Kind of, yeah, there's going to be some of those on there, Tommy in it. Um... I've just been filming with, like, my best mates, like, fucking Jack, Toby, Harry, Freddy, Aaron, and just, like, being proper idiots. And this recording's been so much fun. Um, hence the Minecraft Marshall Pass tweet. Um, so, yeah, yeah, there's going to be some more of that coming. And the Tom channel. And the vlog channel. And I didn't mention this. Here's another cool thing that happened, guys. I did my fourth stand-up gig. Mm. And Molly and her dad came to it. Um, so that's also one of the other, other reasons I've been streaming, because I've been really enjoying doing that. So I've just been doing that like all of the time which is tommy do you have cancer i don't i don't but thanks i just thought i'd clear up that rumor there for that one individual in chat um 
but yeah, that's been really, really fun. Which isn't the tour. You know, the tour is, uh... The tour's gonna be very much, um... My... It's not stand-up. It's not, like, stand-up material I've read, but the tour's gonna be that fucking sick. Um... But yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's been that's been really, really cool. I'm excited to do that and making people laugh in, in person. I'm excited because I don't think it'll be long until it'll be some of you guys in the UK and uh, in Europe. So that'll be sick. Um, but yeah. Am I going to TwitchCon? Probably, yeah. This year. Because I kind of didn't last year. What's the ones up here? Ooh. I'm going to read through some subs as well. And throw me any questions your way as well, guys, uh, you want. Because I imagine this will be a shorter stream than usual. I'm, like, so knackered, I just thought, you know what, I'm about to rehearse for two weeks. Oh! When I'm in America, by the way, when I'm in fucking America, I am gonna do streams. I have lined up a meet-up and stream with Techno Dad really early on, which I'm well excited for. Might do a stream with Schlatt, um, but I'm gonna try and meet up with mates in America and do streams from their setup. Uh, and do some as well, just on the bus or in venues from my laptop. We're going to have a ton of scuff streams. But I am going to make an effort to stream while I'm in America. It's one of the reasons why I pre-filmed loads of videos, so I could just keep going live. Um, so that's exciting, right? I can convince my parents of tickets. I can pay for them. I just need an adult with me. Just find the coolest adult you know. Love Joy Lella. Honestly, a cool adult will enjoy it. Uh, yeah, yes, yeah, so I'm so excited to meet Tato Dad in person. And that, I mean, come on. That is going to be absolutely legendary. Um... Yeah. Tommy, how do you sleep with a ball issue? I either have to sleep face down. I'm going to show you. I'll, I'll show you. It's either <clears throat> completely on my back or I sort of turn around uh, and then like put my head on the pillow. But it can't. Oh, oh God. Ah. Ah. Oh. But it can't be sideways, which is my preferred way of sleeping. So I'm greatly frustrated. Uh, and Molly's going to come out to America for a small bit of it as well. And my mum, which is going to be well cool. Um, so yeah, mate, I'm... I'm oh, yeah, it's going to be sick as fuck. For that thong all day. Please don't call that thong next. And yes. i got to sleep like a grandma. Yeah, it's fun, isn't it? So is this UK, US tour going to be similar to the same... Yeah, yeah, but just improved. With, uh, like, bad jokes. Same story, but with loads of new, new bits and things and shit. Oh. These are quite salty, you know. I'm glad I opened these, but I don't really want them now. So. Hmm. Is the shower all family friendly? The Ben's out cool your family is, really. You know. I'll tell you, uh, Jack Manifold, who's playing my dad, you know, your parents will find pretty funny. Um, but you know, I'm me. <laughs> Wilbur meet up? I don't know if he knows, but me and Wilbur have actually met up a few times. You, thank you for the uh, 24 months. Lulu, thank you for the 16 months. Kieran Dran, thank you for the 4 months. Oh, man. Oh, let's get on another. Yeah, I've been playing so much fucking Animal Crossing New York. And I went on Molly's Island today with my shovel and I just started digging holes everywhere and she got well pissed off. That's fucking old. But no, you shouldn't. Oh, man, is that really a message I just read? Tommy and it makes circumcision 100% funnier. I'm not circumcised, guys. I'm not. My dick's well got loads of skin on. Lo bare skin, all right? I've got so much skin in the game. Honestly, don't worry. Don't worry about me. I'm... <laughs> no, I have to brag. I don't want to brag, but... Too much, if anything. Too much. I mean, makes sex to me. No, didn't have that. No, again, pumping them out. And I've still got both balls. Just 
Ant Venom, lurking at the wrong time. Sup, Ant Venom, as I was just saying, it's just my spermal canal is fixed now, so it, I, I'm, I'm not gonna have a ball twist on tour. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? You can see me on the show and I just collapse on stage and go, Oh, oh God, that's what it could have been. That is fully what it could have been. I just I just fall, fall down on stage and just have a, have a ball twist. Because it could be any moment. It's like FNAF, you know? Any moment, Big Freddy can come. Twist your balls, and that's it. What's that? You know? Hi, Tommy. Are you excited for the tour on any other stuff? Jack and Planet. Freddy are playing off schedule. Where should I go? Do you know? In America. Like, where, where are the... So, okay. Let me go through. Seattle, because it probably might might be the last stream you see from me before I'm in America, which is mad. Obviously, you'll probably get more streams in America than here, but... Seattle, that's well nice for, like, parks and shit, innit? San Francisco, Techno Dad. Los Angeles, Oscar Museum, the Academy Museum, wanna go again. Phoenix, Arizona. Like, what? There's some of these places, man. I can't even picture in my head. What even is Phoenix, Arizona? I'm well excited. I'm so excited to see you lot there. I have, like, you know when I was going around the UK tour, I wake up in Sheffield, I've got a rough idea what Sheffield is going to be like. Boulder? That's, that's a rock, mate. Austin, got a rough idea. Dallas, got a rough idea. Raleigh, Atlanta, Fort Lauderdale, Orlando, what? Uh, Pittsburgh, what is, what is Pittsburgh? What's that? I'm so well excited. Minneapolis, Millerwake, Cincinnati, Cleveland, you know what I mean? I, I'm, well, I'm so excited. I don't, like, okay, where should I go, guys? I'm probably not going to vlog while I'm out, but what, what should I do? I was initially going to vlog, but I was like, I'll die. I'd rather the stream. Where are some hurricanes? Who said about hurricanes, then? You going to Cleveland? Yeah, man, those are all the places I'm going. So if you're near any of them, fucking get, get a grip. Come on. Someone just said... Amazon jungle. Oh, no, it's nowhere near. Space Needle. Space Needle Seattle. My tripping balls. What the fuck is that? This shit, you lot. What in the God's name is this? Telling me I'm doing I'm going to be here. I'm in Seattle for a few days as well. What the fucking hell? This sounds like some out of... Out across Spider Verse, it don't even look real. My, how hard are these drugs, lads? Area Fifty One. Oh no. Mark, apply me up, guys. I'll make. I would really, really, really like to meet Ninja. I'll be honest with you. I'd really like to meet Ninja. You know, <laughs> that's, that's the only one. I, I, really, I just want to. I just want to meet Ninja. Guys, I just want to meet you. Guys, I'm gonna die a happy man if I've met Ninja. <laughs> 47 months, good luck with the tour, Tommy. I hope you feel better. Or should you come to Obama's house? The White House? Yeah, mate. All right. Thank you very much, Peace Over the 47 months. Jesus Christ. Union Terminal at Cincinnati. Let's see, what is that? Because it doesn't sound... It sounds boring. Uh, it's not. Just Googled it. It's not boring. What even is it, though? Just run, don't actually run out onto the White House lawn. I'll be honest, lad, I wasn't planning on, but thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'd love to meet Ninja. Please, Ninja. Please just clip this and send this to Ninja. Ninja, please, come on, man. Mow, 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 mow. Mow, 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 mow. Go to the Gamecocks football stadium. You lot are taking the mick out of me now. Ludwig, I met Ludwig and I chased him around the water park, lads. Hang <laughs> on. Mm. One sec, let me go fill up this water because I'm out of it. And I'm noticing I get very dehydrated if I'm. Oh, man. Sure sucks. Sure fully sucks. Is it feels like a bit that I'm doing? 
you know, I've done, I've done bits like this before where I'm just taking the mick, but it's not, I actually have to waddle like that. It, that's not even, I'm not even, I feel like I should be taking the piss and I'm just not. Oh, for fuck's sake. I really feel like I almost am. Tom, thanks for the content. You're so welcome, Bob Gamer. I'll do it for you, pal. Mm. I've been watching so many films, you lot. I've been watching so many films. Can I just... Look, 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 look. Letterboxed. Let me show you my... Can, I, can you use it on desktop? Yeah, you can. Right, let me show you this, guys. Please follow me on Letterboxd. So basically, I don't use a lot of social media at the moment. Well, I guess I still do use a lot of it. I post on it, but I don't really scroll. But this is one that I do use all the time, Letterboxd. And all you do, all you do is review films. And you can comment on them. And I'll be honest, I, I read my Letterboxd comments. And I've just been going through. Look at this, man. Look at this, guys. I've been writing these massive reviews on... F oh, fuck off! I'm using my ad block. Sorry, that's a box. Let me turn off my ad block. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, it's taking them... Look at this. I've been watching... So let, me sh let me tell you the films I've been watching. I'm so... Oh, God, I've been watching so many good films. I've watched Barbie again. That's right. I pirated it. Soul. Oh, Watch Soul, guys. It's really good. The Sidemen story? It's alright. <laughs> no, it was alright. It was alright. No, 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 it was good. It was alright. No, it was, it was good. <laughs> um. <laughs> oh, mate. Oh. Barbie's so good, man. Uh, Ju Birdman I watched. Oh, that fucked me up. 99 Homes. It was basically, guys, it was this film about, like, uh, being a landlord. It, and it was really sad. And I thought, oh, God, mate. I watched this with Toby. He would fully, he would actually freak out. Um, The Fable. I watched so many good films. Anyway, I'm really just advertising my, I'm really advertising my one social media. Uh, but I've been using that a lot. It's so good. I downloaded Twitch to watch that. You're my comfort streamer? It doesn't feel like this is a comfort stream. Matt Rife? Yeah, I watched his special. It was well wank, wasn't it? Oh, guys. <laughs> you won't believe what I can say about women. Oh, that's well funny, mate. Twat. Move up. I'm enjoying slouching. I can sit up straight if you want. I can sit up straight. Oh. No, no. I'd rather lie back. This is nice. I like taking it on the lower frame. Yeah. It's a comfort stream because I'm scared, lol. How is this a comfort stream? I've been wanging on a mother balls for 30 minutes. I'm not being funny. I've, I've gone out of my balls for so long. This is like the grumpiest I've ever been on stream. <laughs> Stop itching your nose. What do you mean? Stop itching my nose. Josie Elijah, thank you for the uh, 35 months, nearly three years. I feel sick. Yeah, mate, not surprised. That's too long. Uh, XD Beachbone, thank you for the 17 months. Thank you very much, mate. Aventry, thank you for the tier one. Boba Gamer. Oh, all right, Jules. Oh, man. But yeah, I'm going to do uh, some what's it. Seems so done with your chatters. No, honestly, I'm all. I'm guys. I'll be honest. I've. I'm. I'm, so, I'm. I'm done with everything right now. I'm. I'm like. I'm here. Scratching and picking are different. You well, if I was going like this, you know what I mean. That's not on, is it? But just a little. It's all in the nuance, you know. It's all in the nuance. Boy, one month, don't even want to say anymore. Anyhow, hope you're doing well, Tommy TH. So thank you so much to Zari for the sub. Oh, Chelsea Rose, I think with a five gifted. Um But yeah, nah. It's it's gonna be so mad going to America. I'm I'm pretty fucking I am so excited. 
I am. Can't even imagine it. I can't, I'm, I'm, guys, I'm going to be on a bus for two months. I've got to vlog Georgia. Maybe I'll vlog some of it. I just, I don't know. I've been vlogging some more stuff. I've been having uh, some vlog ideas. I'm going to film some of those, especially once I come back from tour. Do you guys enjoy the newest vlog? Because that was the, there was so much fun to film. <laughs> 36 months, Multino Gamer. Thank you so much. Chelsea again with the five given. Thank you. Mate, that bit where Harry fell over. Oh my god. It was such a laugh to film. I got properly ill after filming that, by the way. Like, not not piss around deal. Like, properly had to have three days on the sofa. It, you know, wading through that pooey river. Mate, I fucked it. That kid was a lifesaver. Ah, the boy. <laughs> he just shows up. My last two videos, a small child has just kind of showed up. <laughs> That's fun, isn't it? Uh... ONG Miles, thank you very much for the prime, mate. <laughs> yeah. I want to do ice skating next, I think. I think ice skating would be really fun. That was one of the vlogs I've always wanted to do, we just haven't done. You want to join the net, boys? What other shit has nets in? I'm not being funny. Nets are so much fun. Nets are sick. What other things have nets? Maybe fishing? But we're the fish. I'm mean, almost twining. How do you feel? Oh, fuck me, man. I am, aren't I? Oh, God. I don't really know. You can tell when you're high. I'm not like, actually high. I'm just... Uh, look, just when I... If I shuffle around in the chair, I feel excruciating pain. <laughs> Working in a store or something? <laughs> Why would I... <laughs> oh, yeah, no, yeah. Maybe... Uh, there you go. Thank you for the, uh, good sub. Escape room? I actually have an escape room video that I, uh, I filmed that I haven't posted. That I could go through with James and Turbo that I need to go through the footage of. This is really weird. We did it with, like, heaters. I need to go through that. Occasionally, I'll just film a video and, like, forget about it, and then I'd be like, oh, shit. Hope you enjoyed Boulder, mate. Very cool town. Oh, thank you, Mr. Biggs. Um, so excited to go to Philadelphia show with my girlfriend. Oh, thank you, Chelsea. But I'll be honest, guys. I am I crazy, but I think I'm going to end under the hour mark. This has been lovely to catch up, and I'm so glad I went live because I was like, am I going to have the energy to do this, or am I just going to fall asleep immediately? But I'm so glad that I did. But I do actually feel like like I need to like, go to bed. But I'm so glad I went like, dude, the America stream is going to be so much fun, mate. In a fucking laptop in the middle of nowhere. It's going to be a proper laugh. I think I'll even, like, go out in the middle of a fucking desert in IRL stream. Look, there's a lot of shit we can do. Let me pull up Twitch. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Oh, I'm on the fucking front page. What's that chatting about me bollocks? All right, guys. I'm going to end up shortly. One last question. Go on, I'll answer one last... One last few. I literally got a prosthetic ball put in this week because of texture of the torsion. It's so fucking painful. Oh, Mao Rao, mate, me and you. We're together in our pain. Thank you. Thank you for sharing this, man. Thank you for the four months. Good luck with the tour in America. One last question. Go on. Oh, my days! You see the Taylor Swift fans were getting pissed off at me. First of all... Oh, no, no, no. Okay. Oh, okay. Maybe two more last questions. I've been watching Taylor Swift for so long. So long. I've, I've watched a documentary three times. I was hanging out with some people the other day, and I made them put on the documentary. Molly was there. She was like, Tom, you killed the vibe. I was like, yeah, but I know, but it's brilliant. She really she really delves into her mental health. It's very vulnerable. And these fans, they're what little pricks. I bet I've been watching Taylor Swift longer than they have. Shake it off. Literally the outro of my first video. Do you know what I mean? Little pricks. <laughs> I've been watching Taylor Swift for so long. Uh, no, no, no. I mustn't get possessive. I mustn't get possessive. But you know what's funny? Is my tweets were so great the other day that Turbo had to message me getting hacked. Asked, Tom, did you get hacked? Did you know, guys, know if you tweet out the pride flag, Turbo thinks you've got hacked? What does that say? <laughs> oh. Uh... <laughs> Can you tweet the lesbian flag, flag next? No. Uh, 
Sorry. <laughs> Harry the other day, man, showed me my... My... <laughs> I should bring this up in the video, but I'll bring it up now. It was it was my apology that I did. And it's it's the to uh to lesbians in 2021 was my apology. It was one of the worst apologies I think I've ever seen in my life. It was so funny. <laughs> it was so good. Okay. Oh no. Oh so, sorry if you guys are getting mad. Anyway, goodbye. <laughs> it's so powerful. Sorry, sorry, it's really good. I'll show it you next time. Anyway, I'm gonna end up. I'm gonna uh, we're gonna raid up my friend Harry. Go show Harry some love because uh, I'm not gonna be streaming as much over the next few months than he is. So go show him some love. It's very very funny, lad. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Maddie Future, I think it's only three months. My video of you saying lesbian rights got a private re quote retweet. Yeah, it's because I'm actually very hateful. I just keep it in. As you guys are, any long-term fans of me will know that. Uh, Pink Lady Fire, thank you for the 25 months, guys. Do go to Tommy.com if you uh, if you want to get some tour tickets. Uh, I'll see you in person. It'll be fucking sick. All right. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I'll see you later, yeah? All right. Have a great one, guys. Thanks for watching. Go watch Harry. See you in his chat. Bye, guys. Thank you. Bye.